Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by the title, I have another fashion overhaul for you. This one is holiday themed. So I picked up some good outfits for Christmas, New Year's, and I have picked up a few simple outfits because obviously not everyone likes to be glam for Christmas, obviously depending on what you're doing. And yeah, I did want to pick up a few pieces that obviously I would wear all year round as well. So without further ado, let's just get straight into the haul. So starting off with what I'm wearing because I was just shooting in this one. This is a velvet mini dress. It's a lovely wine burgundy colour and it was £32.99. I did get this in a size extra large and I do feel like it's a little bit snug. I feel like maybe I should have sized up but I'm not actually sure if they, I think they actually did a 1X. So I do think they have plus size in this. It does have a nice little collar and then it does have buttons that do all the way up to this sort of one and then it does they are fake buttons so it is long sleeve a little bit long in the arms but i would just fold it under anyway and then what i really liked about this dress is i feel like the buttons down give like a nice symmetrical look and then the ruching in sort of the stomach area i always find is very flattering and i feel like it does cinch me in very nicely and shows off my shape it is just a little bit snug however like i said like the seam is a bit too far at the front i think it's supposed to be sort of you know more like at my side. For Christmas and New Year's, the colours that come to my mind are like burgundy wine, emerald green, like dark purples, things like that. But I've picked up like a few different pieces because I didn't want to like just stick to the norm. Velvet is one of my favourite materials to wear and I do think they have, I do believe they've got other colours in this dress as well, if this isn't your colour. If I step back a bit, it is a really good length as well. It comes sort of like just above my knees. Yeah, and it does have stretch to it. Obviously, it's just like a snug stretch for me. Like I said, I do feel like I need to size up. And then the back is just plain. And again, it is quite a good length for me. I do find it rises just a little bit. I do feel like the colour as well is quite flattering and it's good sort of to hide some of your cellulite as well. It's not like very showy. But yeah, as well for the price, I feel like it's cheap and affordable it's really good quality as well it is nice and thick so it's not going to be see-through and yeah just a great dress overall i feel like you don't just have to wear this obviously for this time of the year you can wear it for other occasions but yeah this is like the type of vibe that i feel like is very christmassy so next up we have this two-piece it's a gorgeous royal blue now this color i also kind of associate with christmas I got it in a size extra large and it was 31.99. I've tried a lot of these sequin sets from Fashion Over and I actually really like them. I don't find them very like itchy or uncomfortable on the skin. Like they're not the smoothest sequins, but I don't really find them irritable. So I had to pick this one up to try. I absolutely love it. There is a few little bits that I'm not too keen on, which we'll go into in a second, but the top is this really nice one shoulder. It does have like a thin lining underneath that comes to here. And then this bit is see-through and I've kind of like tucked it into the skirt because it is quite long. So it's not like a great sort of two piece on me. Now, the skirt is what I have the problem with because as you can see, it does have this lining underneath, but it is extremely short. And I kind of didn't put two and two together with how high the slit is. So obviously the lining can only kind of come above that. It is a great length for me if I step back. It does come to a really nice length. I do really like the slit. You guys know me by now. I'm always picking up items that have slits in. I just think it's nice to shove like a bit of leg because it is like quite full coverage and then you just have like bam your leg out yeah and the skirt does have a little bit of stretch to it this is quite tighter to get on just because the band at the top is quite hard to get on i've just pulled down the lining but the lining literally don't cover my bum cheek so this is not very practical for me i won't really want to wear this as like any kind of family dinner or christmas party i don't really want to have like all my bum on show so yeah i do feel like with sets as well they're quite versatile so i could just pair this top with like black jeans or something and put it with some heels so it's not too in your face but yeah it's just a shame that the lining isn't longer or the sequin layer isn't like thicker and opaque so it's not going to be see-through because this is actually a really nice set and i really like the color i feel like it kind of goes really nice with my pale skin okay so you guys know i had to pick up pink so this one is a tall version of this dress and it's the family affairs sequin dress fuchsia size 1x and it was 67.99 so this colour is gorgeous. Like the colours I've picked up in these sequin outfits are just stunning. I feel like a bit like Legally Blonde in it. I'm not going to lie. It gives me that like Legally Blonde pink. I wanted to pick up pink because obviously it's a little bit different. It's not like your typical Christmas sort of colour. So yeah, again, it's nice and double lined. It is got the little sequins here. This is sort of like a strappy version and it doesn't have like too much cleavage on show. It does have a hidden zip down here, which you do actually need to do or I needed to do to actually get in it. This one I don't find is super flattering on my shape. I don't feel like it hugs me very well. I don't know. I was expecting something a little bit different, I think. But yes, yeah, so this is the tall version, but obviously if you have heels, it will kind of pick it up off the floor a bit. But 
I would need to probably shorten it anyway. And then again, it does have the really high slit, which I like on this one because it doesn't move. Like this dress actually stays in place, whereas some of the other ones do rise up. I'll show you guys the back. But yeah, obviously this is all double lined, so it shouldn't be see-through at all. I feel like for a 1X, it does fit perfectly. It is a little bit tight around here, which you can probably tell. Um, and then it is kind of not as fitted on my waist. I do feel like it's a little bit steep for the price, just when you look at sort of the other pieces that I picked up. And just because it's not kind of super flattering on me, this is still gonna look great like on other figure shapes as well. And Fashion Nova always has discount codes so you can get these pieces a lot cheaper. <sighs> Can't get the light under control. Right, so this is the last sequin piece that we have. And now this one is definitely my favorite just because of the color and the fit. I don't know if it's supposed to be cow's neck or not, but it goes quite like a cow's neck on me, even though it looks flat like on the models. And that's the only bit that annoys me a little bit because it does kind of drop down and I'm scared like a boob's gonna be on show or something. But I do really like the neckline. I do think it is quite flattering. And then the rest of the dress is very figure hugging and I absolutely love the colour. It is like a limey green. And I didn't say I got in an extra large and it was 57 99 Now I do feel like this one's worth every penny just because I really like it and I really like how it fits and... I think I might wear this one around Christmas or Boxing Day or New Year's. Haven't decided yet. But yeah, it's just such a pretty colour. It does hug me very well. Now, I do need to cut the label out because it does keep going on show. But it does have like a really nice laced up back. And I do feel like I could probably do a bit tighter maybe to not have such like a big cow's neck. So a boob won't fall out or anything. And then if I come back actually. Sorry guys, I'm going to do the light in a minute. But it does have a split up the back and it is double lying. If you guys can see my room right now in the sun, the sequins are like shining everywhere and I look like a little disco ball. <sighs> I'm struggling big time. The sun is like in such an awkward place at the moment. But yeah, this one is perfect for me. It comes to a nice length, kind of like mid shin, I would say. Put it with a nice pair of shoes and a nice like glitzy bag. Yeah, and again, I feel like the color goes really nice with my skin and hair. And yeah, again, it is a little bit on the pricier side, but I feel like I would pay that for this one. It is double lined, it's not gonna be see-through. It is nice and stretchy as well for a size extra large. So yeah, overall I feel like it fits grey and it's definitely like one of my favourite pieces that I picked up. Okay, so this next one is probably like one of my least favourites. I'll go into that in a second. Um, but this one was 37 99 size extra large, it's a magenta colour. I do feel like this is a very like deep purpley plum colour more than magenta kind of what I pitched on the website. I don't know, it's still a really nice colour anyway. It does have like this nice little fluff detailing that kind of goes all the way around and obviously it is a strapless dress or a boob tube as I would say. <laughs> Yeah, I just don't think it's very flattering on here for me just because it's not super tight. I did think for an extra large this would be quite snug, but it's not. So I probably could have sized down maybe so it'd be like more fitted. I think if it was more fitted then this would have been perfect. It does come to a great level when it comes right down to my knee. So it is like a nice sort of midi dress, I would say. And then the back, it does have a zip so you can get it on. And then yeah, it's just playing all the way around. The zip bit here is kind of creating a bump, which isn't very flattering. But yeah, I do feel like if it had fitted more snug, it would have been perfect because it is just too loose and it does have a lot of stretch to it as well. This is a lot stretchier than the red velvet dress that I showed. Okay, so we're gonna move into a few more like simple, more casual pieces just because not everyone wants to get glam for Christmas, obviously depending on what you're doing. And I saw this dress and I had to get it just because you guys know I love green and I feel like this shade of green is definitely Christmassy, like the more darker greens. But yeah, it is a really nice thick ribbon material. It does kind of have like this weird, well it's not even weird, but like a different kind of off shoulder style and I actually really like it. I love showing off my shoulders and yeah, it's just something a little bit different which I haven't tried before. The sleeves are quite long, but obviously I do roll them up and then they are like sort of puffy at the sort of ends. It does hug my figure shape very well. It is lovely and thick. It's such a nice sort of soft ribbed material. I don't know why I keep saying ribbed, but it is definitely like more of a wall. It does have a high slit at the side, which makes it a little less wearable for me because I feel like this is something I could have wore to like work or out and about, but I do feel like it kind of dresses up a little bit and... Yeah, I don't know. I feel like a high slit is like more sexy and you'd wear on like date nights or like occasions, things like that. But I don't know, maybe I'm looking into it a bit too much. But yeah, it does come to a really nice length. It's literally right down to my ankles. I'm five foot four. Show you guys the back. 
just completely plain. I do feel like the price is worth it for this one because it is really nice and thick. It is really good quality. This is something I would get a lot of use out of. Yeah, I feel like it fits great overall. It's a perfect size. It still has like a lot of stretch and room to it. After like several attempts, I think I managed to sort out the lighting. So this next one again is very simple and casual. Again, it's probably a colour. It's obviously like more of like an autumn type colour but I would still wear this all year round anyway. So I've been after a shirt dress for the longest time, like since shirt dresses started coming out and was like a trend and it was in fashion. And yeah, I just never found one. So when I saw this on Fashion Nova, I had to pick it up and try it. And I'm so glad I did because I'm gonna go online and see if they've got other colors because I'm gonna get so much use out of this. Who it is buttoned all the way down. They are real buttons all the way to the end. It does have a collar buttoned up sleeves. And this material is, cotton but it's really really stretchy like super stretchy it has so much room to it especially like on this bit it does cinch me in at the waist really nice like i've said before in previous videos these type of dresses that we call skate dresses here in the uk are very flattering on my kind of figure shape hourglass pairs cinches you in at the waist and flows over and gives you like a nice shape if i didn't say i can't remember if i said i picked this up in an extra large it was 47.99 so it, again it does feel a little bit pricey for me but i feel like it's worth every penny especially how much use I can get out of it obviously it needs a good iron I don't know how nice this will be to iron it's very creased but it's just so cute and flattering you can wear it with tights you can wear it without it's great length on me it has lots of material again the back is a great length I always struggle with skate dresses to get a nice length um, it is longer at the back than the front which is great because it gives a lot more coverage yeah and I just feel like there's so many ways to style this it does have belt loops and it doesn't come with a belt so I feel like you kind of just ignore them or put like a nice black belt, give you a bit more shape, cinch you in a bit more, put it with some black boots or something, black tights, black boots, I don't know. But yeah, I'm gonna get so much use out of this. I'm gonna see if they've got like a black because black would come in very handy. And I feel like with this, you can dress it up, you can dress it down. So if you're not doing anything like extravagant for Christmas, I feel like a nice little dress like this will be perfect. Okay, so next up we have something extremely different for me. I've actually never tried this kind of outfit or style in my life and I, I'm in love with it like I said this was more of the simple outfit but I feel like it's simple but not simple I don't know I would get a lot of use out of this for like occasions birthdays parties things like that I absolutely love the color of it I got in a 2x it, it was 35.99 which I think is super cheap and affordable it's not like thick material I feel like it's just like a nice cotton material but judging by the reviews I don't feel like they were that great or people were saying like the sizing wasn't great like you'd have to size up so I got 2x in this which I'm glad I did but at the same time it is a little bit B in areas so it does make me wonder if a 1x would have been a little bit more fitted so if I come closer it's like a blazer style it has like puffy sleeves there is netting in this which is really kind of like irritating and rubbing my skin so I feel like I would put a t-shirt or a long sleeve just to kind of stop the rubbing because I don't or I could cut out the nets I don't know but yeah it's really great it buttons up here and then it does have a zip that you can do up here so when i first sort of saw it it was kind of like a mission to work out but i got there in the end now as you can see it's really long in the sleeve so my mum's going to cut them and wonder web them for me because i'm not even going to attempt to do it myself so yeah we're going to do that because obviously i would like to wear this and get use out of this and then it does have a belt as well which is quite glam and it is like the matching belt i feel like you could probably put a black belt as well if you wanted to break it up a little bit um, and have like a statement piece I do need to put another hole in this belt because I like my belt super tight and there's not enough sort of little holes for me so yeah I need to do that as well so yeah there are a couple of things that I need to sort out but the colors are just gorgeous I love the the pattern and as I forgot to <laughs> mention it does have shorts so it is like a romper yeah I definitely feel like I needed this size that's what the back looks like my mum absolutely loved this she said it was super flattering especially from the back so Hopefully it is because I can't really see. Super glad I tried something different. I do feel like this is a nice, cheap and affordable piece. It's still nice quality. Okay, so this is the final piece that I picked up. Just bear with me for a second. So I got in an extra large. It was $23.99. Now it is a satin shirt. It does button up all the way down. Has a nice collar. And obviously it is a nice silky satin material. Now I'm going to show you how I would style it. But I just wanted to show you like the length. It kind of like could be sort of like a dress or something you could pair with leggings the back again is super long i feel like it looks shorter on the models in the pictures and then it came out like really long on me but i don't have a belt to hand but i wanted to sort of say like 
you could probably belt it around the middle and have it as like a loose dress obviously if it's long enough for you or put it with leggings or tights something like that this is how i would style it i would put it with some jeans so i did pick up this one as like another nice like simple casual piece because i love the colors of it i love the pattern and it's just very different i don't have any satin shirts i don't think i've ever tried any haven't tried like these colors together and yeah it just really stood out for me so I wanted to snap it up and I would get a lot of use out of this one as well. I can wear it wherever, dress it up, dress it down. I feel like it clothes always look better when you're like completely done up. This is how I would wear it. I would tuck it into some jeans and yeah, this is how they styled it on the models as well. And I just love it. I think it's super cute. I think it looks really nice. I think it's very flattering. I do feel like it's good quality as well for the price. I do feel like it's nice and affordable. I'm definitely going to pick up a few more actually satin shirts because I'm really into shirts at the moment. Obviously this is just like a little bit rough, but I do feel like you could undo some buttons and double knot it and have it like as a tie shirt. I feel like either way is cute but i feel like i would definitely tuck it in i feel like that's more my style but i do feel like with this shirt it's very versatile you can do a few different looks with it and make it look like three different outfits in a way i'm glad i got a 1x i kind of just went for a 1x because i know satin's not going to be stretchy and i wanted it to fit but i don't mind like the oversized sort of baggy look so they were all the items i picked up my top picks will have to be this shirt the romper that i just tried on and the green sequin dress and the brown skater dress i can't pick they're all like my top picks i will leave all the names sizes and the links in the box below if you want to check any of them out let me know in the comments below which was your favorite outfit so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss an upload and i'll see you guys in my next video Thank you.